today we're going to make a pancake and it's called kimchi john. When you say kimchi john, it's actually, of course, there's kimchi and the john is actually the mixture. So um, let's try to do it. So the ingredients are this, of course, the kimchi. It should be sour kimchi. And this is three cups and I just cut it into smaller pieces and then you have to add a little bit of the of the syrup so that it will be okay. I'm planning to make three pieces of um, kimchi john because my kids love it and um, they're still asleep at the moment and um, I'm going to make it for them. And then, of course, we shouldn't forget this um, Pancake mix, Otoge Korean pancake mix. This is the brand that I use. But then, if there's another brand um, aside from Otoge, you can use that as well. Actually, this one is already enough for you to do the pancake mix. But for me, nagtitipid ako, guys. So I have to um, mix it with um, a kind of flour. So, ito yung ginagamit ko. All-purpose flour lang. So, I'm gonna be using this as well. And, of course, I'm gonna be using two eggs for the three pieces of kimchi john. So, and then definitely, I'll be using also water. So, okay. Now, I have here the mixture. I put um, two cups of this but Otogi Korean pancake mix and then one cup of all-purpose flour and then I place also um, 800 ml of water so I'm gonna be putting the eggs now together so let's just mix it Nakita nyo medyo malapot siya. So, just continuously mix it. Bakit hindi siya nag-mix? <laughs> so, kailangan kong i-break yung yolk. Or, I should use tinidor. Okay. So, there are some um, vlogs that you will find. So, this is my version. So, don't compare. Because, actually, this one will really depend on the kimchi that you will be using. And I'm very proud that the kimchi that we will be using this time, because of the quarantine, I started to make my own kimchi. So, the kimchi that I'm using is actually my own kimchi. Pechai kimchi. So, dapat walang bukol-bukol as much as possible. So, the mixture, like what I've said, one cup of the Otogi pancake mix, and then, I, I mean, two cups of Otogi pancake mix, and then one cup of all-purpose flour, and then two eggs with 800 ml of water. So, ganyan siya kalapot. Okay. So, let's start cooking. Let's start the cooking. Of course, hindi ko na binabanggit yung mga certain things na I think it should be logically there na. But then, since we're going to fry, we have to use oil. So, I'm just preheating the pan. I'm using a um, stone pan, so I don't use the non-stick. I don't really recommend it. So, guys, I'm improving. I already have my measuring cup. <laughs> so, this is one fourth cup of oil. And... Medyo ano siya, medyo sinful for me because I really don't like oil. But then, because this one should be, um, yun nga, dapat maraming oil siya para hindi mag-stick. Yan. And then, while you're cooking it also, you need to put some oil if you feel like kulang na siya. So, you just have to do the butter. So, this is the... Kalimutan ko kanina. So, what I'm going to do is to put the kimchi together now. 
let's just mix it together with it while waiting for the while waiting for the oil to be heated na. So, yan. You can also adjust the kimchi if you want to add more. It's up to you. But ako, konti lang ginamit ko for now. But then, if I find it later na gusto ko pandagdagan, well, I can add as well. So, yan ang mixture natin. So, I put all together. You can add, also add puchay or something. So, mainit na ang oil. So, I'm going to put the kimchi now. This is how it should be look like. So, yeah. Napaka-simple nito because ang dami niyang oil. So, I have to move it always because to make sure na mag medyo mag-even siya. So, we have to try making the crust crunchy first before we flip it flip it up. Flip it over pa. Over pala. Sorry. And as I've mentioned, hindi ako magaling na flip. <laughs> so, but I'll do my best. I'll try my best. So, my my um I'm using it a strong ano talaga so medium fire strong fire yung gamit natin so yan and then always check if medyo nagiging ano na ba siya medyo pwede na ba siyang i-flip or not yet so yan seems like almost so I'm going to lessen the lessen the the fire na kasi baka masunod na siya masyado and so, mm, I can smell the kimchi itself So, yung crust niya is actually medyo okay na. But, let's wait for a little longer because I don't want to fail on the flipping part. Hintayin na natin. Tapos, lalagyan ko ulit siya ng konting oil. Yan. So, you cannot really measure the oil because it depends. Sabi ko nga, napaka-simple nitong ano na to. Itong... Well, some of some of you may ag may not agree, but for me, talagang sa akin hindi siya okay. <laughs> Kasi masyari siya maraming oil. I'll be showing you how to flip it because hindi ako magaling sa flipping. So, I'll be using this cover and I will try to flip it. Sana okay siya. Yeah, like that. Oh my gosh. Yeah, na flip ko na siya. Okay. And then I will just put it back. Medyo, medyo dinsunod siya ng konti. Maybe because I was so afraid na hindi siya maging maganda sa paningin nyo. Anyway, and then we have to put additional oil on the sides. So we'll just wait for another five minutes na lang and we're actually done na. Guys, hindi siya sunog ha. Just for your information, it's actually nice. Kasi crunchy siya. So yun ang, ina, yun ang um, ina-achieve natin here. So I hope yung nasa, when I flipped it again, yun yung nasa harapan. So, I hope maganda yung presentation niya. So, let's wait until it's already done. Okay, so, na-flip ko na siya and I just remove it. I will just put it here on our plate. Ah. 
Yan ang ating kimchi chon. Salamat sa tulong ng ating cover. <laughs> and I was able to make it. Excuse me. Yan, so I will just put it on the in the middle. So there. So this is our kimchi chon. Finally. Yan. So, guys, if you like this video, please don't forget to subscribe and then hit that bell button. And um, try this at home. It's really good. Especially if you put more kimchi, it's really, really nice. You must maasim much better. So, thank you so much for watching. Until next time, bye!